Hey McWarrior, welcome back to Opa Plays McWarrior 5. We're at the tail end of the Dragon's Gambit DLC. That's DLC 5. Um, we're on Trulock Prime for mission number one there. There are two missions here. Both of them are 400 tonners. And uh, both of them are basically kill everything. So, let's begin. First step is, of course, mission briefing. Here's what it looks like. Uh, they want to silence somebody. Destroy the target buildings. See, I read from the bottom up. Not really. I just read really fast. So we're going to go uh, demo and kill, basically. 400 ton, that same standard 1.69 kilometers squared, one day. So whatever you're bringing, make sure you've already got it. got a couple of mechs that are really good at demolition and I'm not sure I'm going to get them back for the next episode or next mission so we're going to go ahead and bring them now this guy's good at it twin LBX's and twin PPX's PPC X's so this one's really good uh, I'm going to go ahead and switch in to it take that as my primary role knocking out buildings and make sure the battle mechs all have good weapons groupings at least mine yeah we can go to chain fire when there's nothing else around for that and keep up a continuous stream of boom boom they're a purple beast I think we're ready. Let's go. We've returned home to drive these invaders out once and for all. They have overrun our lands for too long. You're tasked with destroying the remaining Alliance forces. Intel has the Knight of St. Cameron defending the city. These are no amateurs. You're in for a grueling fight. Finally, retribution has arrived. When it's over, they'll the know what other defeat feels like. Proceed to the marked city. Ensure you eliminate any targets blocking your path. So I called us quite a bit of brawling on this one. I don't apologize for it. Target building one. Okay. I know where it's at. Somewhere back in here. Right after we meet and destroy some other big naked thing we're gonna take out. Back. You need to maneuver through the buildings to get to the target, Commander. Push through! Oh, 
Obviously, this mech will not be ready. Well, I got 17 days, so who knows? But uh, it's a beast. It's a short range beast, but it's a beast. Longer range, it can be effective for demo. this game so we just taking a club to everything. General, all night units have been wiped out. It took a lot of blood and sweat to achieve this victory. Do not get ahead of yourself. Knights of St. Cameron remain garrisoned in the area. The citizens of Tronic Prime are still suffering. We will consolidate and hit them with everything we have. We will not stop until every invader has retreated or been sent to the dirt. Consider it done.
Yeah, you know, 11 million C bills is not a bad payoff for that. If you're a salvage kind of guy, you can see what you can pick up. Not too bad. I'm not a salvage guy, so. Hmm. Nobody else took uh, massive damage, so we might be able to just use them again. And the advantage of using the Mackies is they have awesome armor. Oh, got two of them closed out. That too is awesome. Here's your mission brief. So they're retreating and they want us to kill them all. I wonder what that's doing. It says jungle. It's not. It's a pretty big open ass field, tell you the truth. Rolling terrain. Rocks. People want to kill you. 17 days. Nine, you didn't even take any damage. Hmm. Well, 17 days. get this guy up to speed. <clears throat> I got a clay in the yard. How did that happen? They're not here yet. That gives me an extra ton. I'm going to take it. It's the best one I've got. 0 0.25 0 0.17 What are these? One seven. Took care of that. Oh, I got three of them. Oh, I don't need them though. Heat's pretty good. Now it's better. Max that tonnage. Bang. And he's got a guardian. That's 28 days, though. Pipe dream. Okay, dome again. Sixteen days right there. Hmm. For five extra points of damage. And a lot more heat. Hmm. We'll not worry about it this time. I'm going to drop this guy. I'm going into my most favorite, Atlas. And I'm going to keep up with the uh, awesome pink jobs all the way across. The original for him. Um, silver and gold so I know which one's which. Yep, let's go. This is a uh, slugfest, folks. With allies, so use your allies. First time I did the playthrough for this, I finished it. First time I finished it as a standard DLC starting point. Um, I finished it in a king crab with one leg, one arm, and one. I think it was an RBX That's all I had going for me. Slow, fast. 
it simple. Drive out the remaining knights of St. Cameron by any means necessary. This is the moment we've been waiting for. It's Liberation Day! For the Combine! New target. For the Combine. For the families we've lost. And the ones that remain. You speak like victory is inevitable. But there's one problem. You now face Alistair and the Knights of St. Cameron. The true believers will not rest until the entire Combine is liberated from their real oppressors. And you fight alone. Lies! It seems that you have a hunger to die. Don't worry, we will accommodate you. New target. Lincoln here. Requesting new target. Got it. Target acquired. Knights of St. Cameron crossing into the target area. Unleash hell! <laughs> guys coming in behind us. Silver boy back into the lands. New target assassin. Okay, sir, you got it. Forge scout. Target acquired. Roger. Destroy them! 
Back this time means that this hill is back. Nice katana. Ooh, that's not a katana, that's like a... I know what that is. Big guys this time. Looks like the Atlas WGS salmon off to go a little bit of a I hope it was all armor. But plenty of fight remains. There is no telling where the next conflict may arrive. Return to your ship. All armor. Okay. We will be in touch to update you on the state of things. And that's the end of the Dragon's Gambit. We were successful. Well, the dragon was successful, and we helped him become so. Archon Emeritus Katrina Steiner is dead. The Commonwealth mourns. Archon Melissa Steiner Davian has recalled LCAP forces, signaling the end of the war. Due to the Combine's invasion of Arcturus and beyond. Hans Davian has lost, beaten at his own game. Despite the FedCom Alliance's false claims of victory, the rest of the Inner Sphere knows who has emerged victorious in this conflict. Owing to Conray Kurita's wisdom and will to act, the citizens of the Draconis Combine live free. Our way of life has been preserved. Allow this to serve notice to the entire Inner Sphere. The Dragon lives on. And that's the end of the Dragon's Gambit and uh, the end of this episode. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. I do appreciate the time you spend watching. Um, would like to know and hear from you. So tap in those comments, folks. We'll see you next time. Hope us out.